on the west side of Manhattan. An SUV landed on top of a car, crushing the windshield. And just as firefighters were trying to rescue people who were trapped inside of that SUV, one move put everyone's life at risk. News 4's Adam Harding is live on the west side with this wild video that shows us what happened next. Adam. Rana, this was an incredible crash, but it quickly turned into two emergencies. Let me walk you through what exactly happened. So this white car right here was here on 11th when out of nowhere, a car came up on top of the car. You can see all of the scuff marks, and then you can see a tire landed right here in the front of the car. Now, this was the first part of the emergency, and as crews were going to rescue the people who were trapped inside of that car that had rested on top of this car, take a look at what happened next. So what you're looking at right there is a firefighter trying to pull the people who were inside of that black BMW. As they were trying to rescue the people inside, something happened with the shift on that car. The car then moves just enough where it falls on top of a firefighter, injuring that firefighter's leg. We're told that firefighter was seriously injured. His leg is in bad shape. He was rushed to the hospital. A short time ago, we spoke with the family who was inside of the white Volvo that had the car that landed right on top of them. And we heard from witnesses who rushed over to help that firefighter take a listen. My wife and I were stopped at the light, and all of a sudden we just felt this impact, and uh, we saw a car drive up on the, uh, the side of our uh, vehicle. And the car just fell on top of the firefighter's leg. All of a sudden, all the bystanders that were around we just sprang into action and started pushing the car up, pushing, pushing, pushing. The firefighter that his leg was crushed, even though he was hurt, he still went ahead and pulled the driver out. Wow. One hand. He's a hero, 100%. 100%, he's a hero. And I'll tell you, Rana, so many people came to help that firefighter. This is the car that was on top of that Volvo, and that also is where the firefighter injured his leg trying to pull the people out. We understand everybody who was in those two cars, at least four people, nobody was seriously injured. The concern right now is the firefighter's health. Again, as I mentioned, that firefighter taken to a hospital. We understand significant injuries to his leg. We're told the mayor has been briefed on what exactly happened. We're still awaiting exact details as to how all of this happened. That is still unclear at this point, but certainly if you're in the area around 42nd and 11th in Hell's Kitchen, a busy intersection, you'll want to avoid this area as the investigation ran it tonight continues. That's the latest live in Midtown. I'm Adam Harding, News 4, New York.